Welcome back to my channel, Alien Tech Champion. Uh, if you are new, new to this channel, uh, uh, we, this channel is regarding uh, exploring the Microsoft Endpoint Manager and sharing the knowledge on anything related to the Microsoft Intune, Apple iOS, or Android operating systems, right? You will become expert on this if you like and subscribe the channel. Uh, I'm sure <clears throat> if you are an existing subscriber, you already know uh, we are creating uh, some interesting videos and, and just giving information on how you can be an expert and champion on this Microsoft Endpoint Manager. So this is a little bit con contribution from, from my side just to spread knowledge and get aware about this new <coughs> new modern platform right to manage all the endpoints effectively very easily so this tool is very <coughs> very uh, easy to use as microsoft has uh, so this is the uh, endpoint.microsoft.com homepage if you are new you can open this space and uh, if you have if you already know then you you already know about this uh, the portal right so i don't have to describe more on this <clears throat> so in this video i am going to talk about how you can add and approve android enterprise applications and publish to the android devices right <clears throat> okay so f most people are actually wondering there is a how you can add that so there is a pre-requirement you have to go to the tenant administrations i have shown in my previous video so you have to integrate your tenant microsoft tenant with manage google play store to import or approve any applications from the microsoft intune right so i have made some video how you can integrate the google play store with intune you can go and watch to my channel alien tech champion and and then you'll come to know uh, and then you will see this video right <clears throat> if you have not watched that video must stop this video and go and watch that video first and then you learn how you can add and approve these android enterprise applications for android devices okay so what you have to do you have to go to the app sections here go to the android okay and here i have some of the applications i have published already what you have to do you have to click on ads add apps so you see there is store application there is android store application which is normal store applications and manage google play applications okay and then other wave links it's wave url line of business applications android enterprise system applications like camera uh, file system right contacts cloak and other right the, these are the by default android systems right <clears throat> so i am going to show you how the manage google play store app right let's click on manage google play store right you, you want to learn more about this man manage google play store just click it it's very simple microsoft has made just click and right so you see manage google play is the google enterprise app store sole source of application of android enterprise in intune you can Use Intune to orchestrate app deployment through Manage Google Play Store, including the personally owned devices, work profile, dedicated, fully, co Kobo. There are many applications, right? So <clears throat> let's go to here. Don't spend much time here. You can go anytime because this is Microsoft site. Click on that next. Okay. You see here, it's similar. There is two way. Either you can sign in with your integrated g manage gmail account into another tab or it will show here so what you have to do here you search play store private app private app it's line of business applications which your organization has developed or wave applications if you want to publish this any wave url company website internal website to the android enterprise devices right enroll devices so today i'm going to show you how you can add this microsoft outlook application just for sample you can search for any applications so here outlook applications i'm selecting you have to approve it here just get it approved approve 
okay so yeah it's approved okay okay now sync it will it will show here it's very it's very easy so you'll say just refresh it it will take few minutes uh, come on yeah so you see here Microsoft app took I just approve it and it's not assigned to anyone you can filter by column date create it uh platforms other status person you can remove it so okay so i have not assigned and you see this is manage google play store click on this go to the properties scroll down click on assignment you see there is a required applications if you want to force push this application to all android enterprise devices just select all you can assign to the groups and if you select as a publish this application is a required application it will not show in the manage google play store or the company portal or into an app portal right into an app so this is so if you want to uh if you want to publish this application in the manage google play store is available so it will not go forcefully post you can just assign it to all users and then that's it right simple save it save that's it this application has been published in the main is google play store as soon as you uh, enroll your google uh, android enterprise devices in kobo or cope method or in in the even the um, personally on work profile in traditional BYD method this app will be visible in manage google play store and user can of course go to the company portal and download this application so this is quite easy so similar like if you want to add android store application which is not manage google play store so what is these two difference right so if your device is fully managed mobile device managed it's not recommended to the company owned devices or traditional byd i mean mdm enroll then you can then you have to publish this application if you want to publish for unmanaged devices which is byd uh, modern BYD MAM managed without enrollment you can store you can publish this application so as soon as user sign into the company portal those application will be available in their store even even if their devices is not managed through Intune I will show you in the next video how you can create a wave links and Android and add the Android system apps right the Android system apps it's quite easy uh, just you have to select add name if you want to allow the camera you can or or anything uh, camera clock or any system application and just give the publisher name and click on next and submit it's very easy i hope you have learned how you can add and approve the application on for android devices so that you can use and uh, deploy these applications right till then thank you bye bye have a good day